Hey y'all, this is Dick Darren from StraightHustling.com. Are you a hunter or just like to target shoot and have a good time? Then you need to check out Freedom Munitions. You can find a link to Freedom Munitions at the bottom of StraightHustling.com. I can't say enough good stuff about Freedom Munitions. It's where I buy my own ammo, great prices, you buy it directly online and it's shipped to your doorstep. It doesn't get any better than that. You can sign up for their email specials and check out their brass buyback program. So please click the link at the bottom of our site, straighthustling.com, takes you directly to Freedom Munitions and get your hustle on. Let's get on with the show. Y'all check it out. It's Robert Bulls sitting here. We're on straighthustling.com. Check them out. Hit Billy Rockstar album February 5th. Go get yours and check us out on straighthustling.com. Come on. It's much deeper than you're hearing it. You live, love, laugh, then we die. Quit fearing it. You got to live in the moment. You own it. And if you got to kick a little ass, I can do it. I'm talking kicking ass at everything you do. I ain't talking throwing punches every time that you argue. Be a man, stand up, do the right thing. Pay it forward one time, it's a nice thing. You need to live, love, laugh, even kick a little ass. Thank the man for the day. Quit dwelling on the past, cause the future ain't promised and it's creeping up fast. Got to live, love, laugh, and kick a little ass. Yeah. Straight hustling. We got my man Bull from Creek right here. What's going on, Bull? Man, trying to recover. <laughs> yeah. Taking the wind up. All we right. got the hillbilly rock star here with the flip flops on, rocking out <laughs> at the show. What oh, are we going to do, man? What yeah, we had a do? good time. I'm glad y'all came out, man. It's, uh, we just kind of want to show everybody what the live show is like, a little bit of it before we head out on the road next week. Yeah, so. very cool. Thanks for inviting us, man. So we just uh, listened to a brief uh, little uh, bit of the new album that's going to be coming out did a little kickoff here for us in nashville so it's very cool and it sounded great man i appreciate it man we uh we really yeah, the, the the snow last week got us we we missed on three days of practice and i was nervous as hell coming in but uh we got here early enough ran through it i was comfortable it went well and you know with a, with a brand new lineup and new musicians and everything you kind of have to have time to work the kinks out and uh, I, I was really proud of everybody today. So yeah, yeah, I, I was so you're very yeah. excited with it. You're gonna come through with the, this is the uh, the set of the lineup you got. Someone that's going on tour. Yeah, and yeah, right. they'll All definitely right. be here this year uh, for sure. And uh, you know, uh, I mean, because you've uh, been through a lineup change up from what I understand. Yeah, yeah. Hey. I mean, we yeah we have. I mean, Charlie left over a year ago, um, and that was a hurdle that happens you know yeah and, man so i wanted to, i want to touch on your uh new album and also your tour coming up but right. i also wanted to briefly hit on and uh you're a big old dude so don't get mad at it. <laughs> no, this no, is no. nashville you know we're from nashville so this is the type of music we like right know, cool. creek you cool. know jelly roll uh, Black, I'm, I'm a big jelly fan yeah, so all, them, bo- all the boys you know and that's so we want to you know briefly hit up on the cb3 not really get into it but we know he was a big part of the band and uh, can you guys you're going to mend the fences this year and y'all get together. Yeah. and You know, man. I, you guys got a lot of fans together. Yeah, you're right. And, you know, the same thing when uh, Smo and I parted oh, four yeah, years yeah. ago. We had a lot of fans. And, you know, and Smo was up there earlier today. We hey, like, yeah. not missing me. We're super tight. Uh, we hope the way that, that's the yeah. way this ends up, man. Yeah, yeah. You guys yeah. got a you know, Here, Here's good the thing. History. And, and, I, and I've, I've, I've never said anything negatively in public, and, and we'll try not to. But he he's made it known that he'll never – do anything with us. So. Things change, man. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah. right. So hopefully, for the, we're hoping you're, for the you're best. Right. And, yeah. uh, time heals. You're right. Yeah, we're yeah, jelly, jelly roll says. Yeah, time yeah, heals. Yeah, it does. And, 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 you know, and here's the thing. Ken Folk is always Ken Folk. Right, right, right. Always much we, were actually, we, were actually, we were actually talking about that today. It was so funny because all these fans and pitted Smo and I against each other for so long, and they didn't know that like we're going out to dinner once a yeah. week. Like we're well, buddies and all, you know. It's like, they did that with Jason and him. Oh yeah, uh, yeah. oh yeah. When well, they did the same. Been going right. on for it does. It's all well, about what it is. Everybody on their come up. Right. That and, you know? and, and people and fans when when they when they get accustomed to something, they don't like change. Yeah. And, yeah. and don't get well, me wrong, as a band, you don't like change. Things but, all you know could work out best for the end though. Yeah. Because yeah, you, you got fans. Both you guys got fans. You do. Yeah. You do. I just my whole thing was and. I, this is the only thing that I don't care. I, I don't like people out there trying to make somebody choose. I, it's music. Uh, if you no, like music, you like music. You know what I mean? Is, and here's the thing: is when you type in 
Boxing Creek on any any device, you're going to get all the old stuff. Yeah, well, yeah. Right. Here's the thing: is sooner or later, this is going to come out. Right, you know, right. And it all, but the thing is, is you've got to know but, that that there's a different sound. Absolutely. Uh, and, 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 oh, and all change. bands change. They do. Well, so you just gotta Especially in the, you know, I know they call this hip hop. They call this Yeah, well, I was going to ask you, what do you call it? I mean, <laughs> it's rap. I mean, it's rap music. Yeah. And I grew up on rap music, or I wouldn't be doing what I was doing. You know, what right. I'm doing. And hip hop, it ain't no different than hip I mean, uh, Wu-Tang lineup changed every five minutes. You know what I mean? So it's yeah, just yeah, like, exactly. it, it happens. It, it is what it is. It's an era yeah. that, you know, right. was great, and it, it, it put us out there to what we're doing, but, oh. you know. So your new album comes is, out February 3rd. February, oh, February 5th. 5th. Yep. Yeah, February 5th. 5th. And you're oh, touring man. behind it, and you're going what? Oh, and they got the uh, we, rent money tour, right? Yeah, we need <laughs> it. <laughs> we need it. Uh, we've got, uh, we're in 27 states between now and August, so we're covering, right. woo, covering some ground. Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> well, where can the fans go to, to hear, you know, to get all your dates? Everything. The easiest thing is uh, the website, moccasandcreekmusic.com. Uh of course, we're very active on you know social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, all that stuff, and uh, we try to keep them up to date. And right. you know, yeah. I'd be it's crazy. Man. I mean, Facebook is uh, controls what you can put yeah, out yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, it, it, they Facebook just try to make it harder and harder. <laughs> and with Apple streaming and this and that, I mean, you gotta love what you're doing and get out there and grind to make money. You yeah, know, but yeah. we you're we right. love what we do. So. Yeah. Uh, and it shows. But it was it cool, shows, man. Yeah. You know, this this album allowed me to be more me, and that's kind of what I was when I started. You know, a lot of people that know the history, I mean, me and Bottleneck started together, and we right. had a group, Double Wide, seven years ago. Right. And uh, So who was the Double Wide? Me and, me and Bottleneck. <laughs> <laughs> there was a combination. <laughs> hey, hey, there was a combination. Yeah, yeah, but, uh, you know, Jackie does a great job of what he's doing, and then uh, we linked up with Smo, and uh, it's just, you know, it's, it's hard to give up a family and move, and Jackie had a family and all that, so yeah, I mean, I never yeah. knocked that, and Right. And uh, Smo and I had a good thing, but it's just creative differences. But it was never, never anything. Yeah, it turns out good for everybody. Yeah, he's doing well, well, and we're know, doing well. So that's the way. You know. That's the way it all goes out. And it I think, should. I think that you know anyone talented in this business, even though business is business, it is. Ta- well, talent is talent, and you're going to be noticed when you got talent. <laughs> you know, and, and, and that's the hard thing, man. Is I hate to say it because a lot, so many fans don't understand that how much. Of a business, it really oh, yeah. is. A lot you of know, if, if you don't crack, it's, crack, it's, if you don't treat it like a business, you'll never succeed in it. Yeah, right? that's, yeah. that's the hard that's thing. It, man. So you like know, we, drunk at interviews. So, <laughs> exactly hey, right. That song, the song you got, I would pull forward, man. I love that. The Live Love Lab. That was yeah. yeah that's yeah. Uh, that's you know, we started playing that on the road last year, and we we're like, this is so stupid. Like the fans really dug it, and they were looking, and I'm like, oh, we can't even sell this for like a year. We need to take it out of the set. And they're like, no. So, uh, yeah, that's one of our favorites. That and uh, Dirt Road Diaries is my favorite one on the album just because it's an emotional song. But, you know, it's funny because uh, everybody we've let, uh, you know, pre-listen or hear the album prior, and I'll send you guys home with one. It's uh, everybody's got a different favorite, you know, and it, that's, right. that's cool. And I'm the first to say it. I've never denied it. You know, we do have those hardcore fans like, it doesn't sound the same. It's not. Yeah, you yeah, know, right. it's not going to. Yeah. You know, when, right. when D12 split up, it, <laughs> yeah. it didn't sound the same. It's not the but, same band. Yeah, exactly, it, it, it is what it is. It's That's the same right. concept. Right. And here's the thing. I'm not changing anything I've done since I started. Yeah, yeah. Right. But my thing is, like, okay, if, if I, my wife and I, you know, and, of course, the three or four people that were in with us on the business side of things, we worked our ass off for so long to, to build the name. Why would I give up my name? Yeah. Because that's what you know I'm yeah, associated yeah, yeah. with. We got you. So, yeah, it, you know, if, if I take it more hip-hop or more rock or whatever, some people may like it, may not, but we're getting, the more we're on the road, we're getting more new Yeah, things. yeah. So oh, yeah, it, man. It, I see a lot of people kind of on there out. saying, hey, that's just crazy. right across y'all. Yeah, yeah. So, a lot of people know exactly who you are. It's a blessing, and yeah. it's, it's just, yeah, cool. you know, yeah. there, there's people don't get how much luck's involved. And I'm the first to say it. Hard work and I'd rather be yeah. looking yeah. good. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's <laughs> a, man, my, my boy's back home in Florida teasing me all the time because I'm like, I knew 10 or 12 dudes that are so talented that they're playing music, you know, for 50 bucks and a pizza because they just never had the chance to either go after yeah. it. They have or family. It is hard. Yeah, ball's a big part of it. it ball, it's man. tough. I mean, I literally, you know, I sold everything I had in Florida, filed bankruptcy, moved to Nashville, so I'm going to try it. Yeah. Yeah. Makes balls. And man. I got lucky that we had a niche. And I, I truly still to this day, not knocking Colt, I love Colt. He was out doing his oh, thing. Yeah. He was putting it on the map. Bubba's always been around. But I really think that when me and Smo and Bottleneck did the Hick Life song, that really 
Oh yeah, yeah. It really had yeah. an effect on the I, industry. Look, anything, any song comes out right now from any of you guys that has that, that someone plays more than twice it's, has effect on this freaking genre. It, it does. Because y'all are the beginning of it. Well, I, you know, that's a cool thing too. And I just, I, I like to keep steady evolving because I understand, and it's not knocked anybody because I was the first, uh, I was the first one to say, hey, I'll do that too. After two records, it's like. I don't want to write another song right, about beer, were, mud, and yeah, truck. Yeah, no shit, right? Right? And now you've got so many people coming up. Yeah, right. My truck's on yeah. 900. I'm like, yeah, right. what? Or right. the mud. I'm like, you gotta keep I going. get it. That's where you, you find evolve. your fan base. But at the same yeah, time, you got to evolve. And if, you you, evolve. Yeah, yeah, and if they t- if they if they latch on and accept that, it's cool. If not, you're doing what you love to do, and you're not. Yeah. You're not feeling like you're trying to appease somebody. So you know, man, I want to ask you a couple more things. How about like? How's Average Joe's treating you, man? Hey, cool he, label. Yeah, we got a good, uh, good relationship. I mean, you know, no secret. It's like any workplace, you're gonna have issues. Uh, right. and, but I think honestly, the, I'm sorry, and they know. And I said the other day, I think their main issue with me is that I'm hands on and I always want to be working. Not the flip flop. No, no, not the flip flop. Uh, I actually had a major label tell me one time, you got to get rid of the flip flops. You got to stop talking about the rubber oh, flag. You're going to have to die. I said, okay, well, we're going to, I'm going to leave now. So, <laughs> but now, um, you know, it's like, <laughs> we were never going to get into stores and stuff on our own. I understand yeah, yeah. that. Right. And, and Shannon and I had a really good working relationship for years. So why not, you know, come work together and um, help each other in that aspect of getting to places that we couldn't on our own. So, yeah. You know, but I mean, I like to be real hands on. All know. right, well, man, I appreciate you hanging out with us. Nah, I appreciate us a you guys, man. Interview, man. We'll Absolutely. talk to you again soon. Thanks Sweet, for everything. No doubt. Very no doubt. Thank you, man. We think we all got and all the money in the world won't buy you a spot through those pearly gates. No way, start living. Taking this too easy. Be the one giving a smile to someone. Take them to the party. Show them about fun. Let them be somebody. Hope is content. So pass it to a friend None of us really know when the party's gonna end Remember Colt told you Live, love, and laugh Don't ever be afraid to kick a little ass You gotta live You gotta love